Hey Gemini, welcome back to Star of the Universe Tarot. We are doing the What You Need to Know. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I've been doing this a lot lately. Uh, December 2021 uh, readings. If you do not follow me on Instagram, feel free to. I go live every Sunday for week ahead readings. Um, I do love readings. And then I do also um, live new moon and full moon readings. If you guys want to go ahead and check me out tomorrow, Saturday for the um new moon solar eclipse and sagittarius readings we're going to go ahead and get your energies out and um if you guys have not checked out the what you need to know in the next 72 hour readings they have um live demonstrations with my books which i am giving away free personal readings for volunteers who want to participate in these live demonstrations for my books which i have two spots left if you want to go ahead and check those out, that's going to be, um, you'll have the information on the community board as well as the IG. And then if you guys are looking to purchase my book, your um, all that will be in the description box below. All right. Gemini, honestly, I tried to do your reading yesterday. I actually had the whole reading complete and it did not save. So I left your guys's. I was going to do it tomorrow, honestly, because um, I attended a funeral today, um, and um, my, and it was with my baby daddy's family, and a good amount of them are Gemini, so I kind of didn't want to tap into the energy, but I actually feel great, and I feel confident enough to go ahead and get Gemini and Aquarius out today, especially because, you know, I'm sorry for the inconvenience that it just didn't save, but, you know... I always say if it doesn't, you know, if it doesn't work out, then, you know, either that wasn't your message or, you know, I need to change something up. So I tend to take both because I'm a Virgo moon. So I actually changed up the cards as well. So let's see. Gemini. December 2021. All right. So we have dance with life, do something different to change your energy. Yes, just say yes. And trust your path. Ooh, okay. So these are very positive cards. Um, and then you have play, have fun, celebrate, don't be so serious. Okay. Gemini, lighten up. You have answer the call as well. I feel like um, if you're waiting for somebody to contact you, Gemini, uh, communication, I feel like if you're waiting for a text, you're definitely going to get a call. I feel like somebody needs to speak to you. I feel like there's some kind of urgency. Um, yeah, I'm hearing emergency. Danger straight ahead. Somebody might be really into the 80s. You have joy and pleasure. There's a, yeah, there's a lot of good things coming your way, Gemini. I just feel there's completion in your life. There is a lot of um, stuck energy in the past, and there is um, definitely an ending that um, a lot of you guys are putting um, people to rest, and I apologize uh, for that energy. But you're about to, I feel like, really jump into some creative energy here, and I feel like. There's a blessing on the other side. Okay. We have seek assistance. Yeah. Okay. So there was a lot of people. You you needed a lot of communal help. I feel like you definitely were dealing with some kind of community setting here. Um, that just. I feel like you're very independent, Gemini. It takes a Gemini a lot to ask for help. But I feel like because of that, you had so many people uh, willing to give a helping hand here. Yeah, and with change in, change in healing and just say yes, you definitely um, were listening to your intuition and you were giving, um, definitely applying for what you needed to apply. I feel like if you're looking for a brand new job, Gemini, you're going to get that. If you're looking for some kind of promotion, you're going to get that. If you're looking for some kind of loan here with creator god under the under the deck and trust your path you're definitely going to get that there's a miracle coming your way that's why you need to play you're you're in a very fertile place in your life gemini 
and there's going to be a lot of things that you're going to be manifesting for yourself. It may have taken a lot of um, courage here. I feel with the Scamet energy, you could also be dealing with the Leo here or a Scorpio. But I feel like there are times, I, there is a time and place for everything. And I feel like you're, you're in perfect balance, Gemini, and you're in perfect harmony. I feel like there's final. You, you. I feel. I feel like. Ugh, I did it. I finally did it. And then with the forty-four, with seek assistance, I feel like everything came at the perfect time. You manifest. You manifest. You manifested everything possibly at the last minute, but you got it just the way, just exactly how you needed it. Clarify seek assistance. This, yeah, it was it was slow at first, but just know that um, the Knight of Pentacles is the only one that crosses crosses the finish line, right, in the Tarot. So just know that um, it may have been a slow um, process, but it was definitely in your best interest. Yeah, and it may have taken time um, away from something that you thought you wanted to take action on with the Queen of Wands here. But I feel like if you would have took action with the Queen of Wands and the Skemet too early, you actually wouldn't have been able to go through this healing and this change that you you're actually oh, um you're actually like uh, welcoming with open arms. There you go. Heavy emphasis on journey, you guys. Um, don't stop believing. Yeah, with the with the Sun card here once again. Um. Heavy Leo energy with the Skemet energy and the sun here. Yeah, you're you're enlightened to us. You definitely got enlightenment on a situation. Um, there could have been some kind of exposure of some toxic traits, either yours or the person that you're directly dealing with. But I feel like somebody's resilience and somebody's vitality is also shining. Like somebody um, is glowing. That's what I feel with the sun card here. Yeah, somebody somebody's a star here. Um, the sun is also a star like like um planetarily speaking but i just feel like the energy of the glow up is real yeah you could be dealing with the pisces here with the ten of cups under the deck yeah you're happy it could have been some kind of family function as well but i feel like i, I do this a lot gemini honestly i'm like the last person there and the first person to go in any situation just because i'm like that awkward type of person i just can't help um being in large groups for a long time. However, I am happy to like indulge and really socialize as much as I can. But um, it's just, especially in family functions, I just, um, I notice that I do that. And I think that you have some kind of similarity or you are the person you're directly dealing with. Yeah, and somebody just feels like, um, it could be possible that somebody may feel like somebody is like juggling some kind of um, opposing lifestyles here. Yeah, but with the two of cups here and play, if you've been manifesting a brand new soulmate in your life, the answer is yes. You definitely have um, heavy emphasis on um, yes with the world card here. Heavy emphasis on Saturnian cycles being completed here and brand new beginnings coming with um, new energies here with the Ace of Wands. You could be dealing with the fire sign or you could be dealing with the fixed sign here. A Taurus, a Leo, um, three different Leo cards here, you guys. An Aqua or a Scorpio here. But I feel like if you're manifesting... Um, happily ever after with somebody you're definitely getting that because you you did everything you needed to to close out every single cycle that you needed i feel like just i'm hearing just in time for new year's gemini yeah with the guide here as i open the deck and yeah with the beauty here heavy emphasis on beauty and the beast the only like um leo card i'm missing here is the strength card basically yeah, and presently you know that you know your value and you have a lot of confidence here. And it could have been that you had some insecurity issues here in the past, Gemini, but you're definitely moving forward. Yeah, and it's very transparent of how resilient and I feel like how beautiful you are. Yeah, I feel like somebody could have been talking shit about you in the past here, Gemini, and they try to make you seem like you were inadequate or that you were less than, or somebody tried to put you down in some kind of um, communal or um, 
family setting here, but at the end of the day, everybody saw through the bullshit with the transparency here. <sighs> yeah, and I feel like you really released yourselves from from a karmic situation here with rescue, escape from um, escape from captivity and restriction here. You definitely um, could have closed out um, with the world card and um, soul cage here. I felt like a lot of you guys actually closed out a lot of generational curses here. Gemini, ener uh, Gemini uh, Ten of Swords energy. That's also the sun in Gemini. So I feel like um, that's your energy. You're, you're just closing out generational curses here. Yeah, and I feel like it's time to rest here. What time out? Um, awareness, contemplation, and solitude. Like, you need to cleanse your energy. Definitely give yourself time before you um, go out in public again. I feel like you need rest. And um, just know that everything that you've been mas manifesting is definitely coming your way. Clarify the world. Yeah, you have divine sensuality in the reverse. Okay, a lot of you guys could be celibate as well, Gemini. And I feel like that's also what's help, what's helping you, I feel like, with the glow up here. Um, Gemini, I think that not everybody knows this. Some people do, some people don't. But it, it you... Sex ages you. And I remember they told me a long time ago, like, that, you know the younger you start the older you look as you get older and i'm 29 years old. I'm, I'm gonna be 29 <laughs> next year i'm 28 years old right now so and i know a lot of people mistake me like i had a 20 uh 21 year old the other day because i told her i was like oh yeah when i was your age and she looked at me and she goes when you were my age i was like 20 i'm 21 i was like yeah i'm like 28 and she was just like like she just be quiet it was kind of funny she's so cute she i know she didn't mean no harm for me it's just i look really young and i and she looks really young for her age too she looks 16 so i know she's gonna have my same problems when she gets older but um definitely know that if you're saving yourself for this special somebody with yearning here as i open the deck it's they're mirroring the same effect so basically, if you're worried that this pretty ha this person has some kind of third party here, that's definitely a negative, okay? All right, Gemini, I that's what I have for you here, and um, I hope it helps.